Special shout out to all my patrons. All right, let's bring the next person. Hello. Hello. How how are you? I'm good. How are you doing? Good, thank God. All right, what are you here to talk about? So, the first one I agree. Uh, second, I believe it's a, you should spank your kids. You think you should spank your kids? I think that's why kids are very misbehaved today because um, parents are very lenient. I'm sorry, so wait. Oh, she... No, you're, they, you're fine now. They, what, what can they I just... can't hear me. Yeah, guys, it's 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 working now. But if you ever want, if you ever can't hear on TikTok, you can always hear everything on Twitch. Um, can I can I ask what age is it appropriate to spank your kids? Uh, once um, once they're out of being toddler, of course. I I don't believe in abuse, of course, but I think maybe around um uh, ten, seven, and older is okay. I, well, I don't would, mean. I would argue that spanking in, is abuse. It's a form of abuse based on no. Based see, on all the I'm from data. I'm from the I'm from the Middle East. Okay. You know we. That's how my mother grew up. I grew up. My father. You know. You, we your all, mother, and your father all grew up being abused. No, it's not abuse, sweetheart. I disagree. See, that that's what liberals like to say. Who they is this? They think everything is abuse. Who is this? Who's who? Who am I talking to? What do you mean? <laughs> Who is this? Why, do we know each other? Mm, this seems like a troll. No, I. you can check my profile. Um, And I don't believe um, yeah, racism yeah, yeah. is really a big deal in this country nice. anymore because... Who is this? I, I'm, <laughs> I'm not joking. Mm. Uh, so yeah, you, you, your mother and father were all abused if you were spanked as kids. It's, it's not abuse, sweetheart. It's not. It is. See, you can think it's abuse. I don't think can... I use I use fifty years of data to show that spanking causes <laughs> heightened aggression. Spanking causes I can't tell you serious. I'm very serious. We've done because... we've done fifty years of meta analysis on different studies about spanking, and they all come to basically the same conclusion: is that spanking and forms of physical abuse in children all have the same outcomes. So I've I've come out perfectly. I mean. I disagree. You want to spank your kids and you don't believe racism is real. I would say you didn't come out perfectly. I mean, see, but abolish police and prisons. That's not what we're talking about right now. We're talking yeah, about but spanking. That, that goes with that because... I, I don't think it does. I, I think we're talking about spanking. Well, spanking, you've already made your decision on it, so... Well, I haven't, it's not that I've made my decision. You have to provide me with relevant data to disprove the 50 years of data that we have on spanking. Can I ask you a question? Is it okay to if I have a, a a wife or a husband and they do something wrong over and over and I want to correct their behavior or a husband, who knows what I am, and they want to correct the behavior, uh, I want to correct their behavior. Can I spank them to teach them a lesson and to correct their behavior? Your spouse? Yeah. Uh, I know, of course not. I mean, Why not? you're not raising that that your spouse. You're raising your kids. Don't I don't I have a vested interest in having my spouse behave correctly? So that's on you and who you're marrying. Okay, kids take in everything from their parents. Correct, like abuse. Okay, no, it's it's not. Okay, don't call it abuse because it's not abuse. No, it's definitely okay. abuse. Okay, so why is it okay to hit a kid, and not an adult? I'm sorry. So you think that um, someone who's full grown and already is developed and their personality is all there and they've been raised to hit them that oh okay so it's okay to hit people that aren't fully developed yet what if i have someone with because developmental it disabilities keeps your children in line yeah what if i have an adult with developmental disability so he's about as developed as a toddler is it okay or somebody who's like well even about as developed as like an eight-year-old so he's de he's not fully developed he's still learning everything can i spank them See, that's I have guardianship not over them. I have guardianship not... over them like I do a child. 
Uh, I have an interest in keeping them following the rules like I have a child. I have a, I have a vested interest in keeping them safe like I have a child. They are only about as I developed mean, as a child. Can I speak If them? they're developed like a child, then you have to treat them like a child. So I guess that answers it. So I can spank a kid with like severe autism. That's okay. No. So autism is different because um, they really can't control that. So uh, I'm talking about Kids you know, who, autistic uh, kids can control themselves, know. right? Um, not high functioning autism. You mean high functioning autism? What are you talking about? <laughs> There's two different types of autism. There's multiple different types of autism. It's a spectrum. Well, so you, I, I think you just take things a little too literally. You know, you just want to put a label on everything. Well, if I'm, if I'm. <laughs> having a debate yes i want to take things very literally i know but see not everything is all in facts sometimes it's from growing with age you know you learn things not what if what i learned was wrong what if like growing by age i i you're what you're saying is basically you learn from experience what if my experiences are wrong right let's say i'm let's say i'm i'm a billionaire I'm right i grew up as a billionaire in my experience as a billionaire everybody has maids Right, because I, I all I see in my whole life is maids. So I grew up assuming everybody has maids. I would be wrong if I had that assumption. Mm, so it's different because I'm telling you my experience, and my experience is like I I'm teaching you. <laughs> sure. Do you not understand that your experience can be skewed based on your so, personal experiences? You can have a skewed view of the world and your surroundings. So basically. What I'm saying is a civilized society. And most of those on your list are what make society not civilized. Well, hold on. I would argue that a civilized society doesn't hit their kids. So then you're wrong. Also, because what, is civilized, what does in, civilized even in, mean? In the 50s, in the four, even 40s. I mean, why do you think everyone... Why was domestic Why was domestic violence so high no, in the fifties and forties? Everyone 40s? in the old, older generation Wait, is why much you, more why, well why was domestic violence so high in the fifties and sixties? I so I'm not a troll for that. That lady always harasses me. The wake and baker, she's very obsessed with me. Okay, just she ignore the comments. Or, just ignore the comments, or we can just turn them off if it's fine. If you don't want to see them. But what my question is, why was domestic violence so high in the 50s and 60s if it was such a civilized society? Well, I, I believe in gender roles, if that's what you're asking. No, I'm asking why husbands would beat their wives so much in the 50s and 60s if it was such a civilized society. <laughs> well, I think that um, men were very different then. So or could they, it be that they received violence as corrective no. means as children? And so they responded no. with violence for corrective means when they were adults? Because fun no. fact, we have multiple studies to say I'm right. See, but life is so amazing. You know, the, it's not amazing the woman cleans, raised the kids. No, so my, I, I was never hit, so I don't know what you're <laughs> referring to, but... Well, you um, said you were spanked as a kid, so you were hit. So, yeah, I was spanked. Yeah, you were hit. If I did, um, if I did something wrong. Something like if, what? What were some of the things you did wrong you got spanked for? So, basically, um, let's say you have a chore to do, or... No, 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 not let's say. What were specific things you got spanked for? Do you even remember? Uh, I remember. I just, I don't know. <laughs> it really seems like you don't remember the actions that you did that were wrong. You only remember, remember. the punishment. I remember, honey. So what when, if I If I wouldn't take my medication for when I was sick, I would get a spank. Your parents spanked you for not <laughs> taking medicine when you were sick. You were abused. That's not abuse. Oh, That's my God. That's absolutely abuse. My parents, most amazing parents, they were very lovely I mean people. amazing other than the abuse but yeah sure no so you think it's abuse because you're very liberal and I'm not a liberal but you look good I'm and literally you act I'm literally registered Republican it doesn't seem like it so I'm not a liberal because the, I don't know because 
I mean, abolish police and prisons, that's super liberal. If you want to move on to another topic, we can. Just concede that you don't have anything for the spanking conversation. No, I, I know I'm right on that, so it doesn't matter what Great. you say. I know I'm right that the moon is made out of cheese. See, you really, like, See don't how just relate. saying you're right about something doesn't make you right about it? <laughs> I'm right. Okay. Even if you disagree, I am. It's not that I. Anyway. It's not that I disagree. It's that every psychological uh, institution in the country, and it, so honestly, in the world, disagrees with you. I I hope you know that they put those out there for control. Who? And the government. Who? They Who specifically? What what all, portion of the these government? These are all fake. What section huh? of the What section of the government is putting out psychological studies on the effects of spanking children for control? So I, didn't I don't know you, the Didn't you say that you have to spank your kids in order to keep them under control? So if they wanted to keep people so in control, why would they... Hold on, hold on, them. hold on. Why would they put out <laughs> studies about removing something that, in your opinion, causes control if they're trying to control people? Because we, it makes all the kids naughty and makes them all misbehave and it separates society. That is control. How does making kids misbehave separate society? So when we when we unite together and we all agree on something, that's when we can overturn the government. I'm so, sorry. What should we be overturning the government on specifically? I mean, were you not around during COVID when they were trying to force everyone to get vaccinated? I don't talk about when, the vaccine. Well, ugh, I'm not that vaccinated. I never will be. So I say that. would never believe you would, would be. I, you, you don't trust evidence. So why would I think you would get vaccinated? It's not evidence. I, I hope you know it's it population is. control. I hope you know it's not okay. because no one's dying from the vaccine. So next question. Actually, the number Actually, one people in hospitals not. It's not. are vaccinated. You are, I, I you are comments, 18 I times you more likely to catch COVID if you are not vaccinated than if you are vaccinated. No, no, yes, no, no, yes, no. Yes, 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 yes. You can say <laughs> no all you want, but you have no factual evidence to back up your claims. I do. And I had COVID. It was nothing. Good. COVID is the flu. I'm, I'm so glad that you had COVID and felt nothing. But almost over um, almost a million is it a million at this point? People in America had it and died. Well, so no, they, they, they died from the flu, which happens every year. They didn't die from the flu, Miss. Uh, I oh my gosh. Anyway, knock knock. Who's there? Not you. Bye.